Two carjackings over the weekend, both involving someone who thought they were selling something on Craigslist. Victims, though, were held at gunpoint, losing their items and their rides. KTV News Watch 7's Kyle Gravelin is live with more. Yeah, police have always urged people to conduct meetups like Craigslist transactions in very public places. But now they're hoping you'll consider stopping by their stations to handle your business. It started out 20 years ago as a simple email distribution list. Now it's the worldwide classifieds. If you're looking for a video game, or maybe Sparks flew at the bar last night, but you never got a name. Craigslist has it all. Anything that's out there, there's always going to be the criminal element that tries to prey on other people. But it does carry a downside if you're not careful. Last weekend, two separate carjackings occurred that started out as Craigslist transactions. One here at 28th and Poppleton Friday night, another at this Walmart near 99th and Military Saturday evening. Officer James Shade with Omaha Police hopes you'll consider central headquarters or a precinct the next time you're trying to sell that old smartphone. We do have officers that are present and there are cameras that are there. Bellevue's police department set up an area in their parking lot months ago strictly for this purpose, with two assigned parking spots and cameras focused on the spot. If you're planning on meeting somebody to do some type of transaction, this is a great place to do that. Lori Sinowicki with Bellevue PD says it gets plenty of use and it's easy to figure out why. So if uh, a criminal would have bad intentions, they would likely shy away from a planned meeting here in our, in our parking lot. So consider one of these metro safe zones for your next deal. That way it ends in a handshake, not a holdup. In addition to OPD Central Headquarters, its four precincts and Bellevue Police Department, the Council Bluffs Police Department's records lobby is also available for Craigslist transactions on weekdays. Thanks, Kyle. Tonight, the Omaha